So the last thing we want to kind of look at, yeah. you had created a kind of a simple spreadsheet for us, Steve. And if you're if you're listening on the normal podcast platform, you won't be able to see this. But if you will go to uh, YouTube, you'll be able to actually reference this um, and, and look at it. But uh, you kind of created a sheet. Looks looks like you got three different varieties in here. Um, what were the what would be the main things you'd like to point out to us in regards to this spreadsheet, Steve? Yeah, well, obviously you go immediately to uh, how many uh, dollars of nutrients did this acre uh, grow for me on this particular variety. Again, that's that's nutrients that I don't have to purchase because I grew it. And, uh, uh, you know, your 5375 uh, generated uh, $2,700 per acre, uh, partially because of the tonnage uh, being higher than, than the other uh other couple samples we have there, but uh, uh, also um, uh, the protein was a little higher. Um, uh, your starch content was was uh, uh, was good, and uh, the phosphorus brought some things in there too. Um, so our NDF digestibility was the icing on the cake on on that that particular sample. It uh, was just a little higher. Uh, on NDF digestibility than the other two. So between the tonnage and, and the superior nutrition, uh, that one really, uh, really rocked the house pretty well. Yeah, that would be, and, you know, so that would be a good example. And I would put 5375 in the class of that, that hybrid that is, while it does not take a back seat to anybody in yield still delivers a higher level of quality and you can see represented here when you ever are when you're able to combine those two two aspects um what you can look at from just an overall dollar standpoint looking at twenty seven hundred dollars an acre um compared to twenty one hundred an acre on a different variety that we have listed here and i would say a, yeah most yeah. of that came down to tonnage probably yeah, yeah. Then, you know, on our, our test plot, um, you know, we had uh, uh, 17 different varieties of corn silage in that test plot. And on the average, uh, it was about $1,700 is what that uh, had generated. And so uh, there were a couple of varieties that only uh, produced $1,300 worth of nutrients. And uh, um and so all the way clear up to 2700 and so I think about that it was almost over a thousand dollars difference in nutrients that I either grew or I had to go buy yeah and that's huge yeah that, I mean how many of you dairymen listening right now couldn't uh, stand for about a thousand dollars more per acre profit 